Most gracious Heavenly Father, grant me the strength to be worthy in your eyes. Rescue me from the lies of the world and direct me towards you. <clears throat> Elder. It's good to see you, my son. Come, I have good news. This morning, four of our congregation left the safety of the walls. They were to gather firewood near Enderby Forest. Sadly, only three returned. How is that possible? How did they lose one of our own? I mean, forgive me, Elder, but you said this was good news. Oh, but it is, my son. The Lord has presented a wonderful opportunity, a chance for you to prove your devotion to the cause by finding sweet Abigail and bringing her back safely. Well, your equipment has already been prepared. I'll do my best. Thank the pastor for his trust. Well, I will. Show him that it was not misplaced. Abigail! We should get back. Everyone's worried. Hey, what's wrong? Hey, wait! Where are you going? Hey, hey, wait! Oh, shoot! Elder, Elder, are you there? What is it, dear? I caught up to her. She's headed west from the old mill. But as soon, as soon as she saw me, she ran. That's as the pastor feared then. Dear Abigail has turned from the path. I'm afraid at this point she may not come back. Willingly. What do you ask of me? Why, we can't just abandon her to death at the hands of the forsaken. No. No, you mustn't come back without her. Promise me you'll do whatever it takes. I will, Elder. Good. I would just hate to see someone with such potential disappoint the past. We await your return. Abigail? It's okay. It's okay. Come on. It's time to go back now. I remember this place. There were others here. Survivors. Like us. But they refused to join the cause. So the pastor had us sneak in one night and... and... The town was infected. He was trying to protect us. That's a lie. Like everything else. Elder, I have her with me. I think you'd better talk to her. There is nothing left to see, my son. Pastor? It's time Abigail be sent to meet her judgment. Judgment? Through her death, you shall be given new life among my inner circle. Do this. And I assure you, your family will always have a place within our walls. Safe please, from the horrors beyond. Please, you don't have to listen to him. Do it, my child. <laughs> Prove that you belong with us. Those who would sabotage their divine plan must see justice.
It's done. Stay gone. You can't come back here. You get it? If they see you, we're both finished. Thank you. Open her up. Don't feel burdened, my son. Doubt is a dangerous thing. If unchecked, it can spread like an infection, weakening the town from the inside. An example had to be made. You understand. Yes, Pastor. Abigail had many faults, but we can't just leave her to rot, can we? Where did you say you left the body again? Uh, still said, to the west. Ah. That's right. Hmm. My eyes favor the faithful of the land that they may dwell with me. Pastor? But none who practice deceit shall dwell in my house. No one who tells lies shall stand in my presence. Get off me. Abigail. No. You arrogant wretch. Did you really think you were the only one I sent? You thought you could play me for a fool! Protect me. Oh. <laughs> it's too late for that now, my boy. The Lord will not hear those who have fallen into the hands of the deceiver. Prepare yourself. Shh. Elder. It's all right, dear. I could oh, Don't be frightened. No, 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 the starry crown, good Lord, show me the way. Oh, mourner, let's go down, let's go down, let's go down. Oh, mourner, let's go down, down in the valley to pray. Sorry to interrupt. The corporal and her companions are seeking an audience. Ah. Excuse me, we have some new arrivals. More lost souls in need of shelter. Now, to our guests. 